Hey guys, me like big boom here and welcome to unturned 3.14.0. Yes, that is right, 3.14 instead of 3.13 and that is because this week's update is really big. It adds an entirely new game mode to unturned, something we haven't had before. It adds a fully finished entirely new game mode to unturned. Now in the past, up until now, we've only had survival game mode to where you spawn in, you know, you gotta kill the zombies, you gotta loot, you gotta kill players, you know, normal unturned thing, the thing that unturned has been for several years. Recently, there has been a little bit of work done on the wave-based survival mode. I think it's called horde mode, uh, but it's not entirely finished. There aren't very many maps that uh, support it, and it's just kind of a work in progress right now. The arena mode is completed. There are official maps that support it. There are servers out there that are running it, and it is a ton of fun. Now, for those of you who haven't played, Arena Mode works like Hunger Games or Battle Royale and H1Z1 in that everyone in the server is put into a world randomly in different locations and basically need to fight to the death until there's only one person left. Now, currently, there's only Monolith and Alpha Valley Arena maps as official releases, and basically, the Monolith is the arena map from Unturned 2.0, and the Alpha Valley is just dev test. Now all of these maps item spawns have been scrapped and changed to include tons of ammo, health, and gun spawns, and also have nodes placed that indicate the center point of the wall that closes in on the map in order to keep people uh, moving and keep the action going. Now this was pretty much the only thing that was added in this week's update except for a new note. There are now icon PNGs in the extras and icons folder, very useful for me at least, and the hiking and road trip achievements have been tweaked a little bit, the requirements to get them. Now for this update video, I'm just going to show you guys the Alpha Valley Arena map because it's got some buildings in it, and it's my personal preference for arena maps, uh, but I think I might do another video in the future showing off the Monolith Arena map as well. Alright, we are now inside the game now. I didn't quite get to show you guys the, uh, the little lobby, uh, but I guess I'll show you that once I die because, I don't know, I'm not feeling too, too uh, confident about this game. But uh, for those of you, just a little bit of more context on how the game works. We do have a big wall that currently is closing in on the farm, but it also has a chance of closing in kind of in this area right here. Uh, it's just random. And if you're creating a custom map of your own, you can specify multiple locations on where this wall will close in on and it, it will choose it randomly each round. Now my number one tip uh, to you guys, if you're starting off on the arena mode or just simply playing it in general, don't run out there. Don't be an idiot. If you run out there, you're going to get yourself killed. That's just how it works. Uh, run to the closest building, uh, if any, and uh, get some gear. In this instance, I found myself a Heartbreaker and a uh, an Alice Pack, as well as I think there are some magazines in some areas, or maybe I'm not seeing it. Yeah, Peacemaker and uh, Grizzly Magazine. Yeah, not much, uh, but I'm just choosing to, to lie down. I mean, there was 16 players alive when this started, and it's now at 7, and I have done nothing. You just gotta leave them to kill each other, leave them be, don't worry about anything, and then once all the hectic crap has passed, that is when you attack. Six players left. Now this is something more manageable for me, so I think I'm ready to peek out, move into some other buildings, and hopefully be able to win this game. I do see a viper there. Oh, we do see a player over there. Ah, he's dead. Alright, he was already hurt, apparently. I will take it. Also in the kitchens have chances of grenades spawning, so check these. Open up the fridges. Careful, they do make noise when you open these guys up. Red dot sight, awesome. Very cool. All right. Now this wall is closing in on the farm, so you'd better start moving on over there. I'm gonna actually take this adrenaline. We're gonna equip that to our number three slot. And we're gonna run over to the pond over there because there is something special that spawns in there. So we're gonna run, 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 run. Hopefully don't get shot in the back. Now at 0%, back up to 100 just like that, run, 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 ooh, we do have somebody with a timber wolf over there by the trees, we gotta look out for him, hopefully get behind the hills quickly, alright, I think we're good, now what is inside this pond, and I do believe it has a 100% uh, chance of spawning, so if nobody else has gotten it, then it is mine to keep, hopefully once I find that, I'll be able to take out that timber wolf, Ooh, uh oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I don't know where he is. 
I do believe that is it right there. Yes, this is what we were looking for. Now you only have one shot with this guy, so you've got to be careful. Is that him on the hill there? Alright, where is this guy? One shot, gotta make it count. Once I kill this guy, then there will just be one guy left. And then we will be the winner. There he is. Oh shoot, I'm getting attacked by the wall, you gotta be careful with that guy. Shoot. Uh oh, I don't think I can swim fast enough. Uh oh. 21% health left. I don't think it's looking good for us, guys. Yeah, you definitely gotta be careful with that wall. Ah. So difficult, dude. Man, this is intense. I don't know where that third guy is. I had an opportunity to shoot him, but I was really afraid about that wall coming behind and getting me from the back. I would die if he... If that were to happen. Is that him right there? Yeah. Come on, go to the left. There we go, buddy. Alright. Awesome. That right there is a confirmed kill. Alright, and the other guy does... Oh no! He got me in the head! I didn't know where he was! I thought he was up on the hill! Straight ahead. Gosh dang it, dude. Oh man, that was close. I was the second person uh, to survive. But I think that does give you guys a pretty good idea on how the game works. You know, I'm not here to do like an arena gameplay or anything. You know, I'm going to save that later for some PvP moments or maybe on live streams. But update videos are here to inform you on what was added. And I think that pretty much wraps things up in regards to the arena map pretty well. But anyway, that pretty much wraps up everything that was added in Unturned 3.14.0. Thank you guys so much for watching, make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, and do all that gibberish because me like big boom is out. Yeah, you can expect this a lot in the lobbies.